Edmonton Oilers forward Colby Cave died Saturday morning after suffering a brain bleed earlier in the week. He was 25. Kay's wife, Emily, released a statement confirming the news. It is with great sadness to share the news that our Colby Cave passed away this morning, the statement said. Both our families are in shock but know our Colby was loved dearly by us, his family and friends, the entire hockey community and many more. We thank everyone for their prayers during this difficult time. Cave was airlifted Tuesday to Sunnybrook Hospital in Toronto and had been in a medically induced coma after having emergency surgery to remove a colloid cyst that was causing pressure on his brain. Emily Cave and other family members were unable to visit Cave in the hospital over the past few days because of COVID-19 rules. On Wednesday night, Emily Cave posted on Instagram that the family needed a miracle. Many in the hockey community offered support for Cave, including Oilers captain Connor McDavid, who called his teammate, one of the toughest guys I know. The National Hockey League family mourns the heartbreaking passing of Colby Cave, whose life and hockey career, though too short, were inspiringly emblematic of the best of our game, NHL Commissioner Gary Bettman said in a statement Saturday. Undrafted but undaunted, Colby was relentless in the pursuit of his hockey dream with both the Edmonton Oilers and Boston Bruins organizations. An earnest and hard-working player, he was admired by his teammates and coaches. More important, he was a warm and generous person who was well-liked by all those fortunate enough to know him. We send our heartfelt condolences to his wife Emily, their families and Colby's countless friends throughout the hockey world. Players and teams from across the NHL and other hockey leagues expressed their sympathies. Colby was a terrific teammate with great character, admired and liked everywhere he played, Oilers chairman Bob Nicholson and general manager Ken Holland said in a joint statement. Our thoughts and prayers go out to his wife Emily, his family and friends at this very difficult time. A native of Battleford, Saskatchewan, Cave scored one goal in 11 games with Edmonton this season. Originally undrafted, he had four goals and five assists over 67 NHL games with the Boston Bruins and Oilers. As an undrafted free agent from Saskatchewan, Colby chose the Bruins and once he came to our organization, he seized the opportunity and showed on and off the ice that he was a special hockey player in person, Bruins president Cam Neely said in a statement. He was, and will always be a Bruin, and he will be dearly missed by everyone who was lucky enough to know him.